Hello Canadians fans. Welcome to your exclusive Montreal Canadiens news update. I am here to bring you the latest insights into the Habs' recent struggles, especially the scoring challenges faced by one of our forwards. Check if you are already subscribed to our channel so you don't miss any updates we publish here. In Tuesday's game, the Canadians faced a tough loss to the Calgary Flames, marking their fourth straight game of scoring just one goal in five-on-five. Five. What caught everyone's attention, however, was Martin St. Louis' eloquent response when asked about Sean Monaghan and the warm embrace he has received from Canadians fans since his trade to the Calgary Flames. St. Louis emphasized the importance of respecting the game, discipline and carrying oneself with dignity, highlighting how the game tends to reciprocate that respect. However, this feeling seems to have gone unnoticed by Josh Anderson, who, despite following the rules, is not regaining the game's respect. The frustration is palpable for Anderson, currently fourth in expected goals on the team, but still unable to score. In fact, he is labeled as the second unluckiest player in the NHL right now, behind only TJ Oshie. In a post-game interview, Anderson expressed his frustration, wondering if he had somehow upset a higher power. This scoring drought is not a new experience for Anderson, who went through a similar slump in his final season with the Columbus Blue Jackets. However, this time there are no excuses and Anderson is determined to find a way to break the streak. Although St. Louis has recommended humor as a cure for crises, Anderson admitted it worked initially, but now, with a string of scoreless games, frustration is mounting. He emphasized the pain of not being able to contribute to the team's victories. While it's easy to single out Anderson, the Canadians are collectively struggling in the scoring department. Lewis, known for his ability to score goals, mentioned that finishing is a skill that goes beyond coaching. It's about making quick decisions in the scoring department, something the Canadians seem to lack. The team's overall lack of skill on offense is a growing concern, but St. Louis remains optimistic. He believes that if the Canadians continue to play the right way, the pendulum will swing back in their favor and the goals will come. So, Canadians fans, while Anderson's scoring drought makes headlines, it's essential to recognize that it reflects a broader issue. The team is working hard to turn things around, and with the right adjustments, we can expect the Habs to light up the scoreboard once again. Subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for more Montreal Canadiens news, and let's continue to support our team in good times and bad. Go Habs go!